welcome back in my channel and today's topic is binary to gray code conversion and let's take an example and understand how to convert binary to gray so there is a value of binary is 1011 so this is your b0 this one b1 this one b2 and finally this one is your b3 so you have to convert these bits into the gray code so for hit for the first value of it means for the g3 the edited value of binary will you get in your gray code now in a, for your g2 you have to do uh, xor of 1 and 2 so how we do the xor let's see if there are the same number uh, same number like this so it will always give you a 0 if there are the opposite number like 1 and 0 and 0 XOR 1 it will give always you a 1 so if you XOR 1 and 0 you will get 1 and again for G1 you have to do XOR B2 and B1 so in this case again there is a 1 uh, for, and finally for G0 you have to XOR B, B1 and B0 so 1 and 1 they both are the same so answer will be 0 so what is the final result is 1110 so this is how we convert binary to gray code conversion and if you want to see the theoretical representation of binary to gray then it is so you can see for the g3 uh, the edited value of b3 you will get and uh, for g2 you have to exhort b3 and b2 see b3 and b2 for g2 for g1 b3 oh, sorry b2 and b1 for g0 you have to do b1 and b0 right so this is how we can use this theoretical representation or we can use uh, XOR we can solve binary to gray conversion now see how can we do the gray to binary code conversion so this is our example in which there are the gray code that is 1110 this is exactly same so that we can further cross check that our answer is right or wrong for the first value of binary it means b3 the value will be exactly same exactly it will be same and for second one you have to do XOR of, of of this one and this one means b3 and g2 XOR so both values are same so answer will be 0 in this case again you have to do XOR of this one in this case the both values are differ so answer will be 1 again we will do XOR uh, b1 and g0 so that we will get what b0 so answer will be 1 so we can see the answer is 1011 and here is 1011 so uh, we have cross checked that our answer is right so this is how we can do the uh, gray to binary code conversion and if you see the theoretical representation that will be right that will be here see first value will be same second one what will what you are trying to do uh, b3 and g2 so the, for what for whom for b2 so there is b3 and g2 for b1 b2 and g1 for b0 uh, b1 and g0 so this is how we can solve a uh, binary to gray code conversion and gray to binary code conversion so thank you so much for watching this video if you have any doubt uh, mention in comment box thank you so much